6.13 now, a wonderful time just to check in with people we care about, family, friends, neighbors. This morning, I'm doing this just that, checking in with Halloran Hilton Hill. So what you been up to in this whole quarantine thing? Man, it is, uh, it's been crazy. Uh, so uh, I'm working out of uh, my home studio, so I'm broadcasting out of my home studio. So, you know, with the radio show, we, we're trying to make sure that we give people the most information every day. So, so what do you got, like uh, boxers on right now? Huh? What do you got, like boxers on right now? <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm there he is. <laughs> yeah, I got the full warm-up suit on. <laughs> well, um, it, has it been hard not to get out? Do you get kind of cabin fever? Yeah. I, what's been interesting for me is that most of my life I've been a loner, and I'm an introvert by nature. So to be totally honest with you, it's not super weird to me. Yeah. Because I'm a nerd, a weirdo, and an <laughs> introvert to begin with, but uh, but I do miss the human connection. I do miss you know seeing people and yeah. shaking hands and giving big hugs. And, I know it. Well, let's talk about this. You know, a lot of people are are concerned in these times. Um, what hope would you give for those folks that are at home, maybe worried about things? Um worry doesn't change anything right and so and so what happens when when we worry excessively it puts in a, a, a huge strain on mind body and spirit and the real effect is that it actually suppresses the immune system hmm. and that's why having some form of faith or hope or optimism is good for you because it's just good for your health so I'm encouraging people to do something. Don't yeah. just worry. And to be grateful because that's good for your health. And oddly enough to laugh because a joyful heart works like medicine. Uh, because at the end of the day, we're going to get through this. One, and number two, God's in control.